we are, we are living in a very intense and interesting moment. I see that there is evidently a, a lot of movements building up, um, some of them out of, of resistance and rejection of uh, what we are seeing in particular in, in the southern uh, countries of Europe, but also outside of, of Europe, like in Egypt, but also in, in countries like Austria, where we don't face these really severe austerity policies, policies there is really um, a movement building up from below, which is um, starting to think about how can we reorganize uh, our, our, our lives, how can we reorganize our economy towards one that is uh, sustainably, ec ecologically sustainable, that is socially just, and where we are ourselves taking back the control of our lives. And I think in terms of how do we need to, 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 to build the movement or what are the levels, um, we in Attack Austria, we, we have, um, I would say, three or four levels. We think it's, it's really very much important to promote uh, uh, the knowledge about existing economic alternatives from below that people can start building right now and, and also to engage in the building of these. This can be from, from engaging in rebuilding your food system. We are having a very active group or very many, many, many active people that are working in, in the rebuilding of our food system, connecting directly with farmers, starting to build new forms of, of uh, more direct trade between farmers and, and uh, consumers, but also to, to build what is called a, 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 an agriculture of solidarity, where, where consumers become co-producers with farmers and, and also participate in the decision taking of what is grown in this piece of land that a farmer is farming. Um, so that, that, is, that is for us very important to, to encourage this rebuilding of, of the economy from below, um, which is essentially also a very important way of democratizing. And there is a lot of experiences already out there where people are engaging. And uh, we in Attack Austria partly engage ourselves in that, but also see one of the, the key strategies to diffuse this information and knowledge about that there is a lot of things going on. Also making visible and show the alternatives and the experiences that people in other countries are doing. That's the first level. The second level, of course, is how can we connect these, uh, these, these struggles at a national level and people who want to build towards another uh, economy at a, at a national level and there to also um, start working together uh, in formulating what are the policies that need to be changed and also beyond that, how can, how can we or how do we need to change uh, other areas where, which we cannot change at the local level. For instance, the way we are moving ourselves, so the whole mobility concept. You can only, to a certain limit, work on that at a local level because the question of whether you have you know, highways or trains is, is a question you need to deal with at a, at a higher scale. So here we, we have started to build um, uh, an alliance with uh, trade unions, with um, uh, anti-poverty groups uh, that deal with poverty in Austria. We have started to work with uh, uh, environmental organizations and other groups. And, and one thing that we have started to do in an immediate form is to work on, a, on an alternative budget to basically show that for the transition towards a different economy, um, there is, enough, uh, there is enough resources, there is enough wealth, we just need to get it from where it is, and therefore we do not have the need for any austerity measures in, in Austria if we just tax rich people, if we start to tax capital income, and if we also start to tax natural resources, um, and therefore also are able to tax less uh, the, the, the incomes of people, uh, from, from, from a paid job. So that is one first key element of what we are working on. And the second thing is that we really are starting uh, to create spaces of discussion of 
how can we change the mobility and the way we are moving ourselves in, 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 in that case in, in, at the Austrian level? How can we overcome the addiction to, to, to cars where we know we cannot continue and, 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 and have a model of, of moving ourselves um, which is based on people having a car and that the option of moving from fossil fuel fueled cars to uh, electric cars, I mean, everybody having an electric car is no alternative because it doesn't respond to the other challenges that we have, which is to also address the global resources problem and to, to start organizing our economies and, and building our good life on a, on a much lower level of use of resources. So we are creating these spaces where we bring together these different groups and say, okay, we want to move there. How can we address the challenges, the contradictions, and also these cultural elements that are to be overcome? Because we know that for many people, if you talk to them about a vision of, of, of moving around in the future, where cars might be still there, but there might be very few, and we just have them and use them together, uh, they're having a real you know, big problem because they just cannot imagine a life without a car because it represents to them freedom, independence, flexibility. So it's starting a process where we start to discuss that together and find new ways. And then the third level for us that is very important is, of course, we know we are living in, a, in, in, in Europe in, in an integrated economic area. We have the European Union um, and, and uh, we cannot solve uh, certain problems by just staying at these two levels. So we really need to start building also these spaces of interaction between the different struggles and movements at the European scale. Um, so we need to, to find a way where we can come together on a regular basis, where we can start also the construction of, of this other Europe, the discussion and the discourse for another Europe and the construction of concrete um, uh, alternatives uh, in terms of how do we have to change uh, uh, the institutions, how do we have to change rules also at that level. And also I think at a European scale, uh, again, we have this, this challenge when we say not only in Austria we have to change the way we, we produce and consume and to, to make sure that everybody can have a good life but with a lot of less resources. Um, how do we do that also together at the European level? Because if we really want to face the challenge of dealing with the ecological crisis, with the climate crisis, with the social crisis, with the hunger crisis, and respecting that people in the global south have the same right to a good life as we want to have it, then we just need to move away from this kind of economic model that has been uh, the basis of, of um, much of our wealth and the, also the social model in Europe, which is to basically use the resources from the global south to produce something here and then to either use it and consume it ourselves or also to a large extent to export it. So we need to, to also address that and you know, see how we can move away from that um, together. So I think it's these three levels and I think one of the biggest challenge we have at that moment is to really see how we can construct this European level. And I think what we, what we should strive for is really say, okay, let's in a very near future try and, 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 and really build a first step for a space where we try to bring together the different movements and have a structured discussion or start a structured discussion about these things. And I think key issues that we need to start to discuss together are, for instance, how do we really close down the casino? How do we really disarm financial markets? And how do we change um, the whole banking system towards a socially controlled banking system where this financial markets and the banks do not have any more the power they are having at that time and moment over our lives? Mon monde, 
souvenirs des histoires Mon monde, c'est le monde des rêves, les, les. 